a second there. All right. Anyway, with all that said, let's get into MAGA Watch. Let's go. If you're not already a brain-dead liberal, what's going on now is obvious. CNN, BBC, Jew York Times, nice, and many more have called the election for Biden minutes before Trump's lawyer's pr press conference. Something big is about to be revealed to the American people. This is not a coincidence. Spoiler, nothing was released. Nothing was revealed. Yeah, retcon. What could be better? Not much. The shrines, I actually found the shrines really fun in Breath of the Wild, even though they were probably, I would have liked in Breath of the, I'm, I'm getting off on a distraction already, but in Breath of the Wild, I would have liked it if the shrines were uh, less individual shrines and more longer difficult shrines, but that's a minor, minor complaint. Nothing ever happens. Nothing ever happens. Show flag. They're, sh they're scared and committed to the mistake of showing it. Well, nothing ever happened. So they were right. These guys were right. Let's see what's next. The media, with, with triple parentheses, said that Biden is the next president. So it must be true. Well, he did win the American election. Oh, yeah. Well, these are the same NPCs that will believe anything the news says. They're doing it to bury the Trump announcement. Don't let this slide. Pretty much this looks like it's time to go to the SCOTUS. Uh, I don't know what this means. The truth isn't what I like, so it can't be true. The politics forum on anime website said he isn't president, so it must be true. Look at how mad they are. Look at how mad they are. They can't even cope. They can't cope. First post, worst post. Yeah, a lot of first post, worst post. I mean, probably true. Um, this is the first post, right? The original post, or is this the one that's considered the first post? Look at this. They're dumping the Reddit into their brain, and he has a funny long nose. Get it? Do you get it? Do you get it? They're being just openly anti-Semitic here. Get it? Haha. -ha. Is 4chan TOS? Uh, it is, unless it's been censored, um, which it has been. So don't worry about it. See, it's been it's been sent it's been censored. The game plan is not to steal the election for Biden. It's to get the entire left so emotionally wound up that when Trump wins, they will go insane. Worse than this summer. That was always the plan and still is. The media will openly encourage people to burn down cities. And then they have a picture of uh, a stock image of like their their ideal like white waifu. Yeah, I hope so. That'd be Kino as fuck. There is no plan. Everyone is a... Well, you know what that says. And a snake. Nice. Nice. Quality posting here. This is the quality posting. So, so remember, and I want you all to remember, when MAGA people say burning down cities, what they mean is someone set a trash can on fire somewhere in a city. That's what they mean when they say burning down cities. Like, keep in mind that, like, the grand total of buildings that actually burned down, most of them were in Minneapolis, where... The fucking shit actually went down. And everywhere else has just been like, oh, someone set a a, a a trash can on fire. I'm not kidding you. Like, I've people have sent me articles that are like, look at this, Antifa's burning down the planet. They're setting America actually on fire. They're taking a map of America and burning it, and it has voodoo magic in it, so it actually burns America. There's entire cities that are gone. And every time, it's like a, a trash can, or a pile of trash, or a dumpster. And I'm just like... Am I really supposed to be that concerned about a dumpster being on fire? There's a dumpster on fire in basically every town every day. Yeah, it, it's ridiculous. True, silent. True. Every time it was football season in Morgantown, it was impossible to get anything delivered. You want to know why? <laughs> True, Lady Raincloud. There was a dumpster on fire in the White in the White House. Oh, I'm going to let that one go because it's it's celebrating time, all right? Um, America, oh, America's a dumpster fire. What's one more? Good one, gay fish. Boom, psh. All right, now let's get, let's continue the cope watch. Ready? Here we go. Fox has followed CNN's lead and has called the election for Biden. Fox calls it for Biden. Fox was never on Trump's side. Keep in mind, remember, all of these people, all of these people who are getting so fucking pissed about Fox and they're like, Fox was never on the side. These are the same people who just breathlessly re retweet every single thing that Tucker Carlson says, every single favorable thing that Sean Hannity says, every single thing that the fucking five say, that Team America fucking bullshit, every single time. 
all the, all the networks just steal their results from the Associated Press? No. Our, the Associated Press is the official is the official monitor of the election. Yes, that's right. That's right. They are, because we live in a system where privatized companies do it, the Associated Press gets to call that. They are the ones who get to make the election calls because the government contracts them to do so and requires that they do, that they go through a whole bunch of hoops in order to do that. Have I seen this one? No, but I'll take a look at it. Is it censored, Rakasan? Is it safe for stream? I'll check it. I'll check it. Uh, in a minute. Hold on. Where's my pad? Where's it called? What's it called? Oh, I got a new program for typing things in, but now I can't remember what it's called. There we go. Sublime text. Here we go. There we go. I'll save these. Oh shit. It copied the whole thing. I didn't want it to copy the whole chat. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Let's try this again. There we go. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Here we go. All right. Got it. All right. I'll check it afterwards. All the networks just steal their results from the Associated Press? No, you absolute numbskulls. You don't know shit about how the election works, and yet you're on here raging about it and saying how it's a conspiracy, and yet you don't even know the basic facts about it. Fox nor CNN have called the election. It's over. Based, based gay flag truth seer. But, 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 but the Supreme Court is going to elect Trump. It's over. Trump lost. Accept it, snowflakes. These are the comrades right here. These are the comrades. Cope and seethe. It's treason then. It's treason. They're calling. Oh, it's treason. It's treason. It. Remember, everyone, it's treason. It's treason when you when your opponent wins the election fair and square, but it's not treason when you literally lie repeatedly for months in the middle of a pandemic leading directly to the mass deaths of thousands upon thousands upon thousands of Americans. That's not treason, but it is treason when your opponent wins. That's, you know, when you don't get what you want, that's treason. Just, just, you know, just putting that out there. There is no longer a political solution for Americans. In this thread, we discuss strategies to actively resist what is happening. Leave 4chan. Go outside. Have sex. KYS. They elected two N-word within three mandates. I would prefer we don't help them and just let them die and make their make their fall a social experience. Uh, We kill them all. Nice. Nice. Do you think any of these people actually have any intention to do anything or are they just basement dwelling losers? Probably the second one, right? Yeah, it turns out they're just basement dwelling losers who talk a lot of shit and don't do fucking shit. That's not true reason rules, please. Oh my dear God. Reason rules, Jesus fucking Christ. Don't pull this shit in my chat or I'll scream at you. Next, screen cap this. This isn't over with a generic picture of a gun. Do it, Efsler. Cope reported. I love it when obese network ne neckbeards try to act tough on the internet. Put it to your temple, not in your mouth, bud. You are from Venezuela. You won't do anything like all trumpets. Hell, it's about time. Bye bye, Trump. R reported to the feds. Wow. Thing about 4chan is a lot of this, it can just be one person pretending to be a dozen people. Yeah, it could be. But that's always the, the fact on, on, on 4chan. And if that's the case, that cope is even harder than others. That's even sadder. This website is a... I think I'll be taking a break for a long while, Poll. This website is a massive distraction. There's nothing to do here, nothing to say. The election is over. There's, time, there's no time in the history of the United States where multiple s states flipped after the losing party after court cases. Never. It has never happened. You can call me a, a shill, a cuck, whatever the fuck you want. I supported Trump for the last four plus years and I still support him. I think he's one of the greatest presidents this, this country ever had. Holy shit. Imagine... Just imagine the delusion you'd have to have in order to come to that conclusion. Even if, listen, I can even understand, I can even understand someone having enough delusion to believe that Trump is a good president, but the greatest president ever? Holy shit. This is what I'm talking about when we, I've said they've been living in a cult and that cult just came to a fucking rapid end. Rapidly. They just watched uh, the ma the most unbelievably massive failure of prophecy we've ever seen.
And that's why we're doing MAGA Watch. Again. Hey, look at that. See the automated message. Get the hell out of Twitch chat and join the cozy and fiery live chat. You can appear up on the screen right over to the left over here. Left is best, remember. So get up on demonmama.com forward slash live and you'll get in the chat. Get in it. Get in the good chat. We have way better emotes here. It's awesome. Um, Where are we here? <clears throat> Oh, but he lost and his prospects are winning some miracle court case are slim as fuck. I think this will be the motivation for me to get off pole and do more constructive things with my life than hitting the refresh button on catalog and checking for you, uh, for your posts. It's time for some self-improvement and that starts with no more wasting time on this shitty site. It's no better than playing Vidya for seven hours a day. Good. Go back to Israel then, rabbi. Nice. You are part of a massive hive mind. Go back to Plebit, you fucking hardhead shill. I think he's one of the greatest presidents this country ever had. Get ready to join the ranks of boomers who keep saying the same thing out of Bush. True! This is true! Listen, here's the thing, Marinara. They will. If they actually do get off the site, it's amazing what happens when you leave in an, a horrifically toxic environment and just go somewhere else. It's actually amazing how much clearer your mind gets when you're out of a toxic cesspit like Pole. Which, by the way, remember, we went live to Pole the other day. These are, of course, you can see the dates and whatever. These are very, very recent posts. In fact, this one was from yesterday. But just remember, we've gone in there absolutely perfectly raw, live, and we've seen the exact same shit. Anybody who's ever spent any time on 4chan knows just how toxic it is. It is one of the most toxic places you could subject yourself to. And sure, at one point, maybe there were some laughs and some fun. I've certainly had some fun on 4chan back in the day. But what it is now is just a rotten, completely compromised pit of misery. We're going to talk about incels at some point. We got a ton of time to do that. Um, but not right now. But in the future, for sure. I'm scared. I'm scared of Biden. I don't want BLM cuck riots happening near my home. Tell me it's going to be all right, Pole. Just look at this. Imagine th imagine you doing this, being scared of the cuck riots. This is like fascism in a nutshell. The enemy must be both weak and strong. Cuck, they're BLM cucks, but they're scary Biden riots at the same time. Cuck riots. Imagine that. Just imagine what you have to be to be scared of a cuck riot. Right? What do you have to be to be scared of a cuck riot? Well, hey, welcome to the fold, nondescript PHC. Happy to have you. Thanks for the follow and consider joining site chat. Just go to your nearest ice center so they can sterilize and deport me, you dumb MAGA. Wow, nice. It's not going to be all right. You already know how bad things are going to be. There's no point lying to you. I'm sorry. Just kill yourself now. Look at how toxic this is. Look at how fucking toxic this is. Oh, uh, nondescript, you love my Pompo? You love this one? Look at Pompo. You like this one? Look at that. You can get that if you sub to the channel or if you sub to the website. Pompo is amazing. Pompo is our favorite. We love Pompo. Consider subbing and supporting the channel. This channel is completely, completely supported by viewers just like you. Look at that. Look at a 7x Pompo combo. Eight. Holy motherfucking God. That's so many Pompos. Jesus. I love it. I lo 10. 11. What the fuck, chat? Look at you guys. Ah, <laughs> Windleby killed it. But it's all right. Windleby killed it. We love Pompos. We love Pompo. And guess what? Our love for Pompo is pure. Pompo is the product of this channel. We made Pompo live on air. What are we pompoing? Uh, someone complimented Pompo in the chat. So we decided to Pompo and we got an 11 combo. This proves that my community is one of the best Pompo comboers. Well, they're the only Pompo comboers, but we're one of the best comboers on the web. We got a 13 the other day. My Prolax. I do have a, I do have one of those. Uh, it's not in here though. I do have a Prolax uh, pin. I have an original Prolax pin. It's cool. It has a ter- I mean, the name is terrible. It's on my purse. Yeah. It's on my purse. I'll show it to you sometime. Um, maybe later. Yeah. Me too, Gayfesh. Yeah, there was somebody who was at the Vosh hangout, um, who handed them out. Awesome as fuck. Yeah. All right. So we can see here. 
Damn, look at this. Just abject racism. This is what you get when you seek out help. Um, this is what you get when you seek out help from a toxic space of hateful people. One person who said nice things. BLM riots were created to elect him. Why would they, why would they do them now? What? What? Asimov says, don't you feel sorry for Trump? He has been demonized for years and then treated poorly during the election. What do you mean? What the fuck are you talking about, Asimov? What do you mean? Donald Trump is a giant fucking asshole. You know what? Um, one day, one day, we're going to watch on stream um the the documentary about trump's golf resort in scotland has anyone seen that documentary it's actually absurd that was before he was even running for president like a long while before he was even considering it and he's just as monstrous then just as horrible then literally torturing grandmothers i'm not kidding you What's the chance? I don't know. I can't even comment on that at this point, Posadas John. I don't know. They lost so hard. My prediction might be wrong. I mean, we've already seen, listen, we already saw, there were already two thwarted terror attacks. We know about that. Um, yeah. Oh yeah. I agree. Cash, cash. For a second, I thought you were talking about my site and I was like, oh God, but yeah. Just like in incel communities, the vast majority of posters on poll only want to make other people as upset as, and depressed as they are. That's what makes them more susceptible to indoctrination. Yeah, it's the crabs in a bucket mentality. Have you ever heard of that term? Yep, crabs in a bucket. Yep, you got it. It's when you put crabs in a bucket, they don't, they have a hard time escaping because they will pull each other down. They will literally pull each other down. Um, and, and that's the same mentality that you see in um in poll and incel communities it's the crab mentality they reach up and they pull other crabs down and they're never able to stack up even though if they stacked up all of the crabs would be able to get out of the bucket if they work together they would but they just tear each other down crab mentality shitty crabs keep in mind crabs have a very very tiny brain tiny brain very tiny crabs together strong just like monkey together strong the lobster now listen Say what, say what you want about lobsters. Consider the lobster if you so desire. Um, oh, they were trash, a special guy. Um, everyone denounced them. They were garbage. Donald Trump did a horrible job. Um, but yeah. Uh, yeah, they do tear each other's arms off. That's true. Um, wait, why? Wait, why? Because they were a disaster for us. He put a bunch of tariffs on which hurt our business and didn't do anything to China. It was terrible. It didn't even work. Eco like even economists who are right-wing economists said that was a stupid ass move it's because donald trump is incompetent and doesn't know how to actually accomplish anything that he wants to do he just knows how to bloviate and perform for the camera that's it that's all he knows and unfortunately we've learned that that's all you need to do to get a lot of people on board with you as long as you do it with a racist tint yep he had to bail out american farmers with massive payouts because of his own motherfucking tariffs it was terrible trash trash policy kill yourself who else is going to miss the maga era that's what they say on this site not me holy fuck you've been a stain on this website for four years using the same shit ass recycled memes shove that cringy kekistan flag up your ass cope harder not me this no one and it's a, uh, hey, 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 we got us a, we got us an ANCOM over here. We got us an ANCOM. Ah, oh, yeah. Don't cry because it's over. Smile because it happened. Kekistan was a mistake. After this divorce, you lose custody of the frog, you degenerates. True! We got custody of the frog now. We got it. We got custody of the frog. And guess what? We were already taking care of the frog. But now, we got it forever. They're never going to touch it again. The frog is done. And guess what? Probably so is Wojak. Do you want to know why? Because their memes sucked so hard this election. They sucked so hard this election that we got treasures like the, the Wojak and Pepe, you know, the, you know, the, 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 the smug Pepe thinking Georgia. Amazing. Amazing. F in the chat for Wojak. Wait, no, no, no. Not a F in the chat for Wojak. Wojak is free. Wojak has been freed.
He is no, he is ours to use and we will be able to forever use them because here's the thing. They took a gambit. They tried to steal Wojak because you know, Wojak is the everyman, right? It's the, it's the every, Wojak is the everyman and they lost. They made all these crying images, but they were the ones that are crying. They associated themselves with Wojak and now Wojak is ours. And so is Pepe. But here's the thing. Pepe was always ours. Pepe was literally made by a leftist. No joke. There's actually a documentary about how the right stole Pepe. So it's a good thing if more regular people are hurt. What are you talking about? No. No. Do you think China should just be left alone to wreak havoc on the world? I mean, right there in that sentence, spe specular guy, um, it, it shows that you don't know what you're talking about. The idea that you think that China is like some evil scheming Cor company that just wants to kill everyone in the world just shows that you have a racist outlook. Oh, is this the one? Is this the one? Yeah, this one. MAGA. <laughs> Wojak just dodged it. Completely dodged. And then the turnaround. The turnaround. <laughs> True. True. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Ultra Instinct Wojak. <laughs> Boom! Oh, no, 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 no. Yep, yep, that's what we got. Next one. I'm afraid to tell you, you are fired by U.S. citizens. I won this election by a lot! Official sources may not have called the race when this was tweeted. No, I, Gayfesh, I don't use light mode Twitter. I don't. It's just when I open things in site chat, it opens it in an incognito window. I don't use light Twitter. I've explained this before. You all know I don't use light Twitter. This is, this is a character assassination from my regulars who know this. Watch. Ready? Watch. I'll prove it to you and you're going to look really dumb. Watch. Ready? Ready? This is my actual tab. Here we go. Boom. Oops, looks like you all got blown out. The left eating itself once again. Look, I didn't even know what was going to be on this tab. That's how much I wanted to prove you all wrong. I know, Shakachu. I gotta, I, I gotta put the Shakachu emote on here. That one is so good. Yeah, yeah, sure. I just, you know, believe what you wish. Believe what you wish. This truth will speak for itself. Specialer guy. China commits genocide on Uyghurs? Yes, they do. They subvert democracy in Hong Kong? True. They break international environmental laws on fishing zones, intruding, including destroying the ecosystem of the Galapagos Isles? I don't know about that one. The fact that you don't know any of this makes you quite ignorant? I know all of that. The fact of the matter is that China is a country of... Let's just update real quick. Let me just make sure my numbers are correct. Ah! A, uh, it looks like China, this just in, China has a population of 1.39 billion people. That's a lot of people. That's, wow, there's a lot of people in China. And as it turns out, the state of China is not the same as the people of China. And even the state of China is not wholly bad. Keep in mind that we do all kinds of terrible stuff all the time, right? The American state is fucking terrible. Are you kidding me? Special or guy, you got to get over your bias. You have, have got some deep American exceptionalism poisoning. And if you want to learn more, you should consider joining the site chat. Because see, um, ch site chat is good. No, I don't. You're barking up the wrong tree here, special or guy. I definitely do not. In fact, I've talked about it multiple times on this stream before. But it's all right. I know you want to categorize me as some kind of tanky or whatever. I literally am not. You couldn't be more wrong. It's It's really funny. Um, anyway, let's get back to MAGA watch. I know. Thank you. Thank you so much, Retcon. I, I do try to get good at it. I seem like a fascist. All right. Hey, hey, this is your warning, specialer guy. If you don't want to be banned from chat, you better cool it. Cool it. Here we go. Absolute meltdown. That blank will be the first one to judge on hate crimes. He will be extradited to the U.S. and be judged for propagating hate and racism. Hey! Thank you so very much, Feminist Critique, for the Tier 1 sub. You are amazing, and thank you so much for that. Uh, your subs make this channel possible, so thank you so very much. Deeply appreciate that. 
Um, yeah, so that one's a hero told Trump he's fired. Wah. Yeah, look at the raddies. Here's a sad feeling. Guys, I think I'm going to leave the board for a while. I'm not even mad. I just can't stom stomach these Biden shills spamming their dumb fucking whatever shit. I'll be back when things are normal again. Bye, bitch. Still your president. This is a Biden shill. Amazing. Sweetie, this is the new normal. Nice blog. Uh, really is blank, huh? Reminder, disregard all shills. We predicted the media would give it to Biden. Lawsuits ongoing. Supreme Court hearings imminent. Possible House delegations. It's not over yet. It's over, dude. It's fucking over, my man. Fucking over. Aw, oh, little baby can't handle reality. Sad. Get fucked and try and cry more, Trump. Whatever, I don't know. Probably a slur. When we get back to... Oh, wow. Yeah, that one, one we can't read on stream. Yikes. Haha, <laughs> good one. Hey, Specialer, join the site chat, please. Join site chat. I don't want to argue with you over Twitch chat. Join the Chad chat, please. Please join the Chad chat. Trump won. Biden wins. Trump won. That's the point. Yeah, obviously he won by a lot. Trump rally inauguration day, January 20th, Washington, D.C. Be there regardless of who wins. I see they're, they're trying to imitate Q here. Oh no, it's okay, Silent. Don't worry about it. You're good. You don't need to apologize at all. You did enough. Excuse me, sir, but actually Joe Biden won. He won a prison sentence. Listen to, oh, fantasy land. Absolutely fantasy land holy shit losing your candidate by one percent libertarians having one percent of the vote kunk yep true guess what it was a jojo tag team you know it was a jojo joe tag team because we had joe jorgensen and joe biden and the jojo joe tag team fucking boom took them right out the libertarian dark horse we never expected it we would have never seen it coming. Lefties, be honest. What did Trump do that was so bad? Lol. Lol. I don't watch JoJo. JoJo's bizarre election? True. Oh, Atono no Aji. What the fuck? Why don't you have site chat privs? Uh, let me give you site chat privs. Give me a second. Did I forget? I may have forgotten to update your account on the site. Give me one second. I'm going to give you your site site uh, also, I forgot to mention, Atona no Aji is also one of our mods. So give Atona no Aji a big hug in chat. Give, give Atona no Aji your hugs. The, uh, hug emote, you know? Because Atona no Aji is now a mod as well. Wait, where's the rolls? I gotta do my rolls. Yeah, you finally, you, Atona no Aji, you've been around since the early days. You really have. Here we go. And done. You are now, you now have the right to mod. Wield it effectively and well and carefully. There we go. If you type in chat, you'll see your fancy name. It's not that fancy yet because I haven't done the custom icons, but it's still kind of fancy. It's pretty, pretty fancy. Yeah, you got it. It's pretty fancy. It's pretty fancy. Hey, Dr. Scrubs. All right. Lefties, be honest. What did Trump do that was so bad? In before archive due to no responses. Thanks, friend. Spat empty fucking promise and did nothing but try to split America under his own fucking narcissism. Uh, we got some slur tier president. Generally being a dumb slur with zero culture that preferred to speak before he thought. Nothing that you people wouldn't agree with anyway. Bump because I still never got an answer. He said mean things. Tuck, tough talk isn't a crime. So basically... They said, oh, there won't be any responses. And instead, the responses are full of coping right-wingers who literally won't, aren't even open to the idea that Donald Trump was a shit-ass president. Uh, soon, Retcon, we're going to do an event. We're definitely going to do an event. How many breads have I tubed in my life? Hmm. Hard to say. Probably a lot. My throat is, is a tube, technically, you know? So I probably, I probably tubed quite a lot of bread. If we think about it that way. Do you really think this is over because the 
triple parentheses media says so. Trump isn't giving in and there's actual evidence of voter fraud. This obviously isn't over and this shit is going to be contested. Which way do you think the Supreme Court is going to swing? The Trump will remain president and the left will seethe massively and it will be glorious. Watch the terrified shills flood this post like the N-word they are. Bump, yeah, the current raid is the worst one I've ever witnessed. It's very obvious to anyone with a functioning braid cell. All according to plan. All according to plan. This is so funny. Imagine being on 4chan. Imagine being on 4chan and using the fucking Republican GOP icon. Look at this. How sad do you have to be to be on 4chan, the, uh, the, the you know, the dark subculture underbelly of the internet, and you're proudly displaying your support for the mainstream GOP. Incredible. Yes, and, and they those have been completely debunked, by the way, Devious Chilster. Totally debunked. They're just... The, the, the accusations so far of voter fraud have had no grounding. No grounding in reality, which we all knew. They make up new shit every single day, but they've had no grounding. The, the supposed dead people is was literally... The, did you know that those posts were... Those specific posts were commented on by the attorney general in Michigan and was like... Uh, yeah, that was a clerical error on the website. It doesn't affect the votes at all. It was just the website. It was just a clerical error on the website itself. Doesn't have any fucking... Yeah, exactly. Let them have four dead people. They could even have a million dead people and Biden still won. Still won! Being a conservative is the real punk rock. I saved a video of that for later too. Attention lefties and paused... Paused... F slur ass shill celebrating over Biden and that Jamaican poo and slur just like poll is our containment board Trump was our containment president you have no idea what's coming your way with 70 million real pissed off Trump voters over the next four years if Trump has this election stolen from him you think the tea party was bad hint it wasn't really that bad it was mostly just embarrassing you just unleashed all the people who hate the NWO and pinko commie F slurs and Trump was our hope to dismantle it we've sat by while you have all assaulted us thrown your temper tantrums and rioted guess what F slur it's our turn to give you back everything you've done to us and more with the way you've acted over the last four years nobody is going to give a flying fuck about going too far anymore oh i know i know that's what they mean uh posadas john yeah it's horrible it's a, a very dated insult based 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 Okay, but who's it going to be? There's no one based in the pipeline anywhere. Where are they going to come from? They need name recognition. And who is it? True. True. There is no one. There's no one. No real leftist supports Biden. I can't wait till the class war begins and we send you to the gulag. Uh oh, the one guy got caught, the one actual voter fraud got caught, which is what we talked about in the months leading up to this, that they always catch people who do voter fraud and it always gets negated. So, wah, wah. is there lag? Why is there lag? I shouldn't have any lag. I don't know what's up. Everyone get the fuck in here. Fraud has been proven in a number of swing states, but we can't rely on the courts. The saving grace is that the state legislators may select their own electors to go to the electoral college. All key swing states are controlled by Republican legislatures. What we must do is call every single state Senate House member and tell them if they do not acknowledge a fraud in their state and appoint electors for the illegitimate victor, the president, we will never vote for a Republican again and will support a challenger for their seat. It's time to win this poll. This does this. This hasn't happened. They didn't, they didn't even get the strategy. We talked about this strategy. Remember, we talked about this, um, this strategy. Oh, the ooh lag. Oh, I get it. I get it. Sorry, silent. I'm dumb. Um, yeah, like, it, like, remember, remember, we talked about this scenario and they didn't do it. They couldn't pull it off because they didn't have a convincing win. In order to pull this off, they needed to have a convincing win. They needed to have a convincing win. And they didn't. They didn't. So they can't do this strategy. We talked about this in advance. Remember I told you the last time this happened was in, uh, was in 1877 with the Ulysses S. Grant thing? We talked about this on stream with uh, Vivian Wolf. So are you MAGA's going to start the Civil War or not? As it turns out, most of the MAGA's um, live in 
totally isolated areas and just prefer to get mad at their TV instead of doing anything real. That's just how it is. You're going to hear me in the news tonight. Peter Brachman. Remember it. Watch. Hey, let's find out. Let's find out. Peter Brachman. Obituary? I don't see anything here. No news for Peter Brachman. Sounds like Peter Brachman was a fraud. Let's look in the news category. No, it wasn't. That obituary was from 2005. Has there ever been a state result that was overturned after a recount? I don't think so. I don't think so. Because the problem, the thing is, the reason why that's the case, Sal 771, is because we actually have a pretty good grasp on voter fraud in our country. Voter fraud barely happens. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true, Silent. Yeah, yeah. I don't want them to die either. Well, looks like Peter Brockman didn't succeed. The fake politics that Donald Trump embodied is coming to an end. The lie told to average white Americans and dissidents alike is that we held power and we were defeating our enemies through the antics of this buffoon is slowly being revealed for what it always was. There are real questions to address regarding how working and middle class whites can benefit from an era of democratic he hegemony. Yes, there will be tons of woke gar gar garage. But Medicare for all UBI are in the air and they will likely become policies within the decade. Trump's exit is the chance for a new beginning. I embrace it. I hope others will too. This is the Nas bullshit. This is the quote unquote right wing populism. Also cope. Also massive cope. Keep in mind that though Richard Spencer supposedly supported Biden this election, who cares? Uh, Don, Richard Spencer ran the fucking unite the was a huge part of the unite the right rally. Which ended up being a disaster. Today, I am going to fly. Whew. Baboon attacks prime minister. Local man's death ruled suicide. Oh! Oof! Oof! This is this energy. True. It's kind of sad, but true. This fucking egg lord, edge lord, is a complete f slur, and I wish to never hear of him again. Wow, Paul was right. This guy really is controlled opposition. Coping, coping. Actually, Sao seven seven one. You might be surprised. It actually is likely. Um, I I disagree with you. I think that it is likely. In fact, um, it's possible we will see some kind of uh, of UBI next year. We'll see though. It might happen. It's probably going to be a shitty one, but it's very likely. Um, I think people, one of the things, one of the, the, the downsides of the Trump era is that, um, of the Trump era is that, is that people have not been paying attention to the state of America, of America's economy on the ground. Now, yeah, Wall Street is doing fine for now, but it's all speculation. It's all a massive motherfucking bubble, like massive. So, you know, everybody's been paying attention to Trump. But meanwhile, nobody has any fucking money. Nobody has any holdings or wealth. Nobody can spend anything. There is a depression going on. There's going to have to be some form of stimulus that doesn't involve buffing uh, corporations. It's just a fact of reality. President Trump, when the time call comes, call up the Patriots. Use the emergency broadcast system. There are 50 million armed Patriots available. This tyranny cannot stand. Those of us that are armed can readily arm those that aren't. 50 million is a ridiculous underestimate. Imagine thinking that you will get an army of 50 million Trump supporters in the streets. Even in the wildest fantasy, that is off the rails. Ooh, I'll put this one in the list, Twitter. Or, uh, Rakasan, sorry. I was reading the name of the, of the post. There we go. We'll look at these ones. Bumping or truth. This, imagine wanting to die for a millionaire Jew Yorker. Nice, nice, nice. Fucking anti-Semitism there. What's a, a quiet, small, remote, trad, white country? Enslerlandia? I couldn't say, but you certainly won't be accepted there like some anime fantasy. USA, stay, fight, win. Lol. Post your internet history and let's see how trad you really are. 
You have you have to find the correct N word Jew ratio. Nice. More anti Semitism and racism. What's stopping LARPers from making their own commune? Oh wait, they're just Annie Soys and want to farm and gay trad shit like that. Is there a particular place you know that may imp implement UBI soon? Well, no, because we're still in the fallout of the election. But I, I, but here's the thing: Canada passed a UBI. Canada passed a UBI. Michigan obituary hunt. This is their attempt to desperately try and locate people. This was I, I took a picture of this last night. Just so you know, Dominion is the smoking gun. Don't lose faith. The Supreme Court will speak. The observers were not allowed into the counting rooms. I won the election, got 71 million legal votes. Bad things happened, which our observers were not allowed to see. Never happened before. Millions of mail-in ballots were sent to people who never asked for them. Bingy. Bye-bye. Yeah, you don't do that stuff here. By the way, he's done. He's done. Yeah, it is shit, but it's still UBI. That's what I'm saying. Ooh. Yay! Yay, Cash. That's amazing. So we've seen them all now. Or have we? We have a few more. We have a few more to do before we bring Snowdrift on. Yeah, Trump is throwing a massive fucking fit. A massive motherfucking fit. Like, absolutely massive. He's been just pitching a fit for, like, fucking two days. It's ridiculous. Here we go. Here's another one. Here's some more cope. Wait, hold on. I got to make sure that this doesn't have any uh, swears in it or anything. Not swears, but... Even though he won, this scary time has been an improvement event for Patriots, too. It gave us a stark reminder of what it would have been like if Biden really did win. Censorship would become total and complete. Truth channels would be targeted, criminalized, and shut down. Conservatives would be subjugated, disenfranchised, pushed out of the system, and persecuted to the fullest extent. Globalist, Luciferian philosophies would overtake every educational institution by decree. Holy shit. Holy shit. So unhinged. This is why we will never let globalist tyrants steal our country like they attempted to do now. Never forget what we almost lost. Now let's get it done once and for all. What is this, Parlor? Is this Parlor? This is a clip from Parlor, right? I wish I had as much confidence in Biden as the right wing does. I know. They think that, um, they think that, um, fucking D biden is the the most communist leader that's ever existed in their entire fucking world it's it's actually wild a actually unbelievable yeah globalism's pretty based as it turns out there's a lot of um it, there's a lot of fucking um well i lost my train of thought because i saw peacecraft in chat hey hey just so you know I'm going to nuke that phrase. If people just come in here and say Trump 2020, I will literally just, just fucking ban you. Sorry. There's like a whole bunch of people popping up in the Twitch chat, just saying Trump 2020, because they don't have, they have one brain cell and it's been written Trump 2020 on it. It's really funny. Um, it's actually hilarious. Uh, cope 2020. That is what it is. True. Hmm. I wonder if there's an auto response I could do. Yeah. They have nothing better to do. They have nothing better to do than just say, uh, Trump 2020, even though he's objectively lost, completely lost the election. It's actually hilarious to me. Let me see what the other one is. We got one more. We got one more that Rakasan sent. Let's check in on it. And then there was one other that I wanted to show you all because it made me laugh really hard. <gasps> Re Damn it, Q, where are you? We need you more than ever. We have been abandoned. Soon this thread will be d deleted by janitors, uh, which is uh, mods. I guess he was fake all along. Wow, you think? You think? Hey, thank you uh, very much for the gifted sub, Devious Chilster. Um, also, uh, yeah, nah. Here's the deal. Actually, here's the deal. Curious Kit Kat. I will say that thing. Three. I want a tier three sub. Tier three sub. Tier three sub. Give me a tier three sub and I'll say it. Deal. We'll have a deal. 
I'm waiting. If you give me a tier three sub right now, I will say exactly what you want me to say. Oh, come on. You don't have 20 bucks and you're a Trump supporter? You're a Trump supporter and you only, and you don't have 20 bucks? You don't have 20 fucking bucks and you're a Trump supporter? What the fuck? Yeah, there was a fake gay fesh in chat. Peacecraft is in, uh, is hiding in, in the other chat. You live in the mountains? Curious, Kit. Listen, Trump is not good for you. How about this? If you give me a tier one sub, I will tell you why Trump is not good for you. How about that? How about that? Thanks to the wonderful, wonderfully generous, devious Chilster. So, yeah, you're poor here. I'm poor too. I understand. That's why my content is free. And I tell people that my content is viewer supported. So like, sub, comment, all these sort of things. And you can actually support and make it keep happening. Yeah, we'll, we will fight exactly, precisely, Yuk. We will fight. Listen, I will fight for every single one of these MAGA people who want, who were willing to vote for a president who wanted me dead. I can look by that. I just want you to get universal health care and fair pay. No more exploitation, even for the MAGA sirs. That's how it goes. That's the thing. The great thing about being a leftist is that by default, you have the moral high road. It's awesome. It's fucking amazing. It's incredible. So there you go. Oh, Biden's not going to listen to me, but I don't care. Curious Kit Kat. I don't care if Biden will listen to me. What I care about is affecting change. And I don't need Biden to listen to me in order uh, to affect change. You see, right now, there are 76 people watching my channel. And those people are hearing what I have to say. And then they tell other people and we learn together and the world becomes a better place. I don't need Biden specifically to listen. I need people to listen. Just people. Anybody. You, your friends, anybody. You all listen to me. I will help teach how we can build a better world. That's the cool thing. That's the great, that's the wonderful thing about being a leftist edutainer. I don't need to talk to the president. I don't need to suck up to some fucking MAGA dude. I don't need to lick boots. I just get to talk to people, real people who have real feelings and can institute change in their, in their lives. Aw, that's okay, Paul. Don't worry about it. Y'all proggies? What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Um, I have yet to be able to buy a sub. I was gifted a sub on Hannah's and also Jake's channel, my only Twitch sub. Paul, don't worry about it. My content is free. You can support it if you have the money by subscribing but if not just enjoy yourself just enjoy yourself that's why it's free i make it free for everyone progressives yes i'm a progressive i think that's a fair statement he will he already has listened to some progressives the thing is here's the thing again he doesn't have to like or want to listen to us in order for us to make wins keep in mind the squad has grown keep in mind the progressive wing of the Democratic Party is gaining in power. It's gaining in popular power because we have people power. AOC didn't win with money. AOC ousted a 15-year 15, 15 incumbent with people power alone. People power. People willing to go out and do the work. And that's what we bring to the table. That's what we bring to the table. So there you go. Enjoy your free sub to the site or to the, um, to the Twitch chat. Consider joining the website where you'll have a lot more fun. You can hang out and you can learn from me. I think you'll have a great time with my um, with my community. Consider joining the website. There you go. Enjoy. Enjoy. Come on in. Yeah, he already moved his platform left because of Bernie Sanders. Of course, it's not enough. But yeah. I had another thing saved that I wanted to show you before we uh, get too, too into it. Hey! Devious Chilster with the second gifted sub. Thank you so very much. Thank you so very much. Look at that, Paul. You are empowered. You are empowered. All right, and Devious Chilster is offering one more gifted sub. You need to beg Devious Chilster. Devious Chilster, you could also gift somebody a site sub too, so consider that. Hey, we got a raid. Chud Logic, thank you so very much for the raid. Welcome to all of the Chudsters, all of the uh, Chud Logicers. Hey, I'm very happy to have you. Remember, the website 
is where the cool chat is. So if you want to come and hang out on the website, you can have a lot more fun. We have more emotes. It's cozier. There's a lot of people on here. So come join the website. It's right there in the chat. Demonmama.com forward slash live. You can even sign in with your Twitch. It's super easy. So come on in. Come on in. And it looks like we're there is a, a devious chillster. Our wonderful community member is offering one more gifted sub, but you got to beg him. So consider, or you got to beg them. Sorry, don't mean to mess up any pronouns. You got to beg them. So beg them. Beg, beg, beg. Get begging. Get begging. Oh, yeah. Here's another little piece of, uh, of, of, uh. Hey, there you go. Devious Chillster got it. Bam. There you have it. You have a sub. Thank you so much. Thank you so very much. Oh, uh, and Retcon, 404 Retcon says, uh, saying, Chud is awesome and his stream is based as fuck. True. Chud's stream is one of the most fun streams I've ever watched in my entire life. Huge inspiration. I hang out with Chud all the time. We play fucking Apex Legends together. Chud, if you're still here, you are awesome. And thanks for being here. And thanks for the raid. Anyway, we're finishing up MAGA Watch, and then we're going to have a really fun night after that. So get comfy, because we're going to interview Snowdrift, we're going to listen to some of Snowdrift's brand new album, and we're going to talk about the tracks and do like a full-ass music interview. And then afterwards, you all get to vote on what game I'm going to play. So that's fun as fuck. You get to choose what game I'm going to play. It's cool as shit. Yeah, it's going to be music listening. We're going to, oh, it's going to be so great. Ah, uh, Chud's audience can deal with you again. It'll be a good conversation. So, Chud's audience, get comfy. Come hang out in the site chat. We would love to have you. Goddamn liberals. Goddamn. And again, Devious Chillster, you rock. Thank you for the gifted subs. You make it all possible. Y'all make the magic happen. Seriously. So, again, purely viewer supported. Always will be. Let me just show you this. First Lady Melania Trump has joined the growing chorus of President Trump's inner circle, advising him that the time has come for him to accept the loss. A source familiar with the conversations tells CNN. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's She wants that divorce so bad. She's itching for the divorce. You know it's going to happen, too. You know the moment that Donald Trump is out of office, she's going to file divorce paperwork. And I'm going to feel so good for Melania because, you know, I'm just saying... Melania doesn't seem particularly happy living with Donald Trump. And I can't imagine any woman being happy with Donald Trump. So. The link in the bio says site under construction. On which bio? Oh, you mean on the main website? Uh, it is. We're waiting for an image, but that's it. Did I see the Steve Bannon tweet that got him permabanned? I didn't see the tweet that did. I did see his comments. Not even MAGA ladies. Are you kidding me? Melania is a MAGA lady, but she's not happy. Are you kidding me? That's nasty. Yuck. Chud logic. What's going on, liberals? All right, Chud, that's it. Don't you fucking dare call my chat liberals. Me? You can call me a lib if you want, but you call my chat a liberal, and it's time for us to go. Oh, she's totally going to get a, a get a divorce. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Join the site. I'm not a lib. Don't worry, chat. I'll defend your honor from the villainous Chud logic. Yuck. What are you doing here, Jimmy Big Nuts? I don't know. Come hang out. We are about to talk to a wonderful musician named Snowdrift Moon about his brand new album, and then we're going to move on to playing video games. Disgusting liberal sanctuary you've got here. Hmm. I'll destroy anybody who calls my chat libs. We do have some libs in the audience, to be fair. Help, help. Felicia is talking about what Trump probably says in the bedroom. No. Oh, God, no. Is Melania true MAGA or is she involuntarily MAGA? Probably a mix of both. I mean, I imagine that she has similar worldviews to Donald Trump, but probably doesn't have them quite as extreme. Um... <laughs> Anybody calling for pragmatism is called a lib on the left. Eh reports of these have been overstated there are a few loud people there are a few loud people who are like that but i don't think that they're going to be the most influential going forward so uh and there's one more tweet one more tweet before we end maga watch and get snowdrift on here snowdrift i hope you're i hope your the seat of your pants is ready 
Ready for the ultimate cope? The ultimate cope? This is the last one. The ultimate cope. Styx Hexenhammer 666 posting this. The evolution of leftists over the next two years. 2020. <laughs> Get fucked, Trump fans. Biden will soon give us UBI student debt forgiveness and free health care. Um, so at least COVID is gone, CNN says so. How did the Republicans get a leg legislative supermajority? They're impeaching Joe. I'm shaking right now. Trump keeps laughing on Twitter. Fuck my life. Yet, and I said, what I had to say to this was, but Sticks looks like the 2022 Wojak right now. He really shouldn't be throwing stones. Have you all seen Stick Sticks Hexenhammer? Actually, you have because I just showed him on stream. Um, let me just show you. We, we just looked at him on stream earlier and he does indeed um, look like, look, this is him right now. This is Sticks Hexenhammer right now. Look, this is him. He looks just like 2022 Wojak. Let's put them side by side for comparison. Here we go. Side by side for comparison. Wait, hold on. Let me make sure. Here you go. Wait, I, fuck. Here we go. Can you see this? Can you see these? Hmm. Damn, there's some similarities going on there, isn't there? He's got a, a a military hat on here. But, you know, I'm just saying, he's already looking a lot like uh, 2022 Wojak here. And this is an old image of him. This isn't even the freshest shit. You want to see the freshest shit, we can go visit his YouTube page. Let's take a look at how Styx is, is holding up. Don't show the lewd folder. Oh, no, I won't. I won't show the lewd folder. Don't you worry about that. Let's take a look at how he's doing these days. Uh, here's, oh, hey, look, here we go. Here is him, his thumbnail is him picking his nose. See this? Look, he's picking his nose. Um, he's downgraded to always wearing a robe on camera because he's lazy. I am not aware of fem sticks. I don't know if I want to. Let's, uh, let's see how he's holding up. Sad, haggard Jennifer Rubin. Stop worrying, lol. Our republic has survived worse. All right, everyone. Keeping in mind that Joe Biden is not officially the... He's looking pretty rough for the for around the edges. Got some pretty deep bags under those eyes there, buddy. Got some pretty deep bags under those eyes. Just saying. You know, just saying. Just saying. So, yeah. With that, we conclude our MAGA Watch section of the day. And don't worry, there will be more. Stick should hire Gina for thumbnails. Holy shit, that's true. He doesn't even use them. He just lets YouTube generate them. He picked his nose. Yes. Keep, remember how lazy right-wing content creators are. The laziest motherfuckers you could possibly imagine. Just, they're so fucking lazy. Their content is so motherfucking lazy. If they can't pay for it, they don't do it. That's just how it goes. If they can't pay someone else to do it, if they can't fucking, like, literally, I just mean drop money on someone that doesn't ask any questions. They don't do it. They won't do anything themselves. They won't ask for help from friends. They just, if they can't pay it, they won't do it. And he has the money to do it, which is stupid. But he knows he doesn't have to because his followers don't give a shit. You got, you got here in time for a molding. True, I'm always molding, aren't I? I'm a, I'm a molder. I'm a, I'm a molder. That's why we got the molding mama. I, I mauled from time.